The Ontario College of Social Workers and Social Service Workers regulates the practice of social work and social service work in Ontario. The College ensures professional and public accountability for the thousands of registered practitioners in our province. It gives me an expectation to live up to, to um, continue to grow and learn within my profession, you know, knowing that the information, um, the research changes on an ongoing basis and it gives me a way to be more accountable, um, someone else to be accountable to besides just my client and my employer. So I often have the pleasure of uh, giving advice to MSW students who are about to graduate and are finishing their field placement with our organization. And what I generally will say to them is, A, make sure you keep learning, make sure that you have, uh, you make time for self-reflection about your practice, for self-care to look after yourself and last in this career, and also to register with a college. Advice that I would give to a new practitioner is to really understand um, the standards and the expectations of the profession, that it gives you a good guideline of what boundaries you need to set with your clients and the best way to help them. Only registered members of the college may use the titles or represent themselves as a social worker or social service worker in Ontario. It's the law and it's an important way the college protects the wide range of clients that members work with. You've invested a lot in your education and training and are entering a competitive and challenging working world. I think my employer is happy that I'm a registered social worker knowing that I'm abiding to a standard of practice and values and guidelines that the college offers and the professional practice support that we can receive if we ever run into any ethical concerns or other dilemmas that we may have with our clients from our day-to-day -day work. Registering with the college is the next step in building your professional career and demonstrates to employers and clients that you are professional, ethical, qualified and accountable. You're spending years of your life becoming educated as a social worker. So you've made a commitment to the profession and in order to call yourself a social worker you need to be registered. It opens up lots of opportunities and speaks to the professionalism that you can portray uh, in your work every day. My advice would be register. Visit the student and new graduate section of our website and find out more about becoming a member and about the new grad fee.